Texas Tech basketball coming into Saturday 4-0 on the year. Easily their toughest test of the young season, though, on Saturday, playing host to the University of Arizona, the ninth-ranked team in the country, and most of the more than 10,000 in attendance in white for the wideout. First half we start, Josh Gray picking up right where he left off against Jackson State. The steal and the finish. Tech after a quick two to nothing lead. Jordan Tolbert battling foul trouble all night, but a great start early. Trency Jackson inside to Tolbert, ties it up at four. And Tolbert though held to just nine minutes on the evening. Wildcats starting to push the lead with a 10-2 run. Jay Crockett though, one of his two threes on the night. That to get back within three midway through the first half. Crockett with a team high 12 points. On the night, Arizona though answers with three straight threes, a 9-0 run, and Arizona taking a 45-28 lead into the half. Tech down 25 now, four minutes into the second half, but here come the Red Raiders. Kadir Tapsoba inside to get the run started. Todrick Gocher up and under bucket and the foul back to an 18-point lead. Next possession, Jamal Williams with a long two and the crowd back into it. All of it part of a 14-2 Red Raider run and not done yet. Next possession, Daylon Robinson for three. And all of a sudden, Tech back within 13. But Tech running into foul trouble for much of the night and running into a hot shooting Wildcat team shooting 57% for the game as Arizona wins at 85-57 the final. First loss of the season for the Red Raiders, but plenty of lessons learned on Saturday. I think that team's a Final Four team, you know, and uh, that that's a tall challenge for us right now, uh, given where we are. Not that you know we're giving in, uh, you know, we, we respect Arizona. That was a really, really good team, and you got a chance to learn. It gives me a chance to get my players' attention. And say, guys, that is what we want to be. You, you know what I'm saying? That is where we're trying to get to. It was a tough loss. Uh, they just came out there with a better team today. We made a lot of mistakes. We didn't play together like we need to, and. I just feel like we just gave up too many rebounds, second chance shots, and they, they were just on tonight. They were making a lot of threes. I thought it was pretty challenging because they're big, they're really big. And then if you have somebody to back you up, it's a good thing. But if you have to play them by yourself, it's kind of hard to deal with. But unfortunately, my over two teammates got into foul trouble and we had to deal with it. The one thing I'm, 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 I'm impressed with our guys about their intestinal fortitude and how they did not give up. They, had, they, held, they held their head high, and we do the fight song. Everybody's right there with their guns up, and that's what we're all about. We're all about pride, you know? And again, you're not going to win every game, and these guys aren't going to get down because they lose a game. And we're just going to look forward to the next game. And again, I told these guys, the most important thing is when I stop talking tonight and when, they, with the, when they're with each other, what they say and how they relate to each other and what they say when they leave the locker room. Other than that, we're good to go, and we get ready for practice tomorrow. Next up, Tech back at home on Tuesday night, hosting Northern Kentucky, a 6 o'clock tip from the USA. For Texas Tech TV, I'm Brandon Rouse.